Yo guys, what is good? So a bit of a different review today. Um, yeah, a bit of a different review, right? We're gonna try out Moments Rekelme. Um, you know, this is kind of like a review that I wasn't expecting to do, where uh, EA was gonna add in a new icon. But uh, I know it's I know it's a, a big question mark, right? This is the most popular player on Flippin' now, two days in a row. So we're gonna go ahead and purchase him, right? I haven't really seen him that much lower uh, than like 2.7, 2.8. So we really shouldn't lose too many coins on this guy. Um, he's been fluctuating a good amount, uh, in general. So, I mean, we'll just see. I haven't seen too many people buy him yet. Um, this guy has obviously tried him, but it, it looks like an interesting card. Um, and obviously when we're doing this review, I want to try out the best version of this card because I want you guys to get the best idea of what this guy offers. Now, traits wise, he has flare shot trait and outside foot shot trait. He's got the five star skills, uh, with the four star weak foot as well. Um, and then he's got medium low. Uh, medium attacking, low defensive work rates, 75 pace, 90 shooting, 95 passing, 94 dribbling, and 71 physical. So medium low is not the best, um, but it's also not the worst. When I look at this guy, you need to play him as a cam because of his low pace. Um, he has low acceleration, low sprint speed. Uh, he's got good attack positioning, good finishing, uh, not outstanding, but great long shots, great shot power. So outside the box shots are going to be excellent. Um, he's got amazing passing. That should be the highlight of this car. The passing is unbelievable. Uh, and then the agility, the agility, the balance, the reactions, um, the ball control, the dribbling, the composure. I love that his composure is 98. Um, the agility at 84 is it's a difficult one because you kind of want to put a hunter on this guy to boost the acceleration sprint speed. So it's a, it's a bit of a challenging thing here to figure out what exactly you want to do with Rikel May because it's not easy to know what to do. And then he's got 78 stamina and 75 strength. Uh, to go with all of that. So it's it's a really weird one, man. I don't know exactly how I want to play this dude yet, but it's got to be in the cam roll. Um, he's a right-footed player and he's six feet tall. I love the five-star skills. I mean, any player for me in FIFA Ultimate Team that has five-star skills is just a lot of fun. Um, so I think that in a way, I really look forward to that because I, I you know, I love five-star skillers. It's a, it's a good time on FIFA. So what we're going to do, this was the uh, the Serie A squad that, uh, that we had created. And I think we're not going to use that team. We're probably going to go with like, more of the main team, whether it's the Prem team. Let's go with the Prem team, right? Let's check that out. So this is what we have for the Prem team currently. Um, so I'm going to add in um, Rikelme into the squad. Rikelme. Let's get him in there. And so, yeah, so 92. And I, I think for me, right away, we're going to go with the Hunter chem style uh, because you just need to try to boost the pace as much as possible. Um, the Catalyst is not necessary because he has really good... Um, he already has really good passing. And then it's tough. Like, I, I know the agility. For me, guys, like, look, 84 agility for a lot of people is good enough. For me, it's not. Um, but it kind of has to be sacrificed here where I could use an engine. But then again, I want the finishing to go up. Uh, I want the finishing to go up a lot more than what it currently is. So it's a tough one, man. It's not an easy one. Uh, wow, hunters have gone down so much, man. I remember when these guys were like 15K when the price range just got updated. So that is crazy. So we'll go ahead. We'll pick up the hunter. Go to the club. Apply the Hunter. And we'll get some gameplay, man. We're going to play some Division Rivals. We're just going to kind of test them out. Um, you know, it's not going to be like Weekend League or anything like that. But we're going to try to get the best test for how this guy is. You know, what what this new icon offers in foot. It's, it's quite interesting that it's a new icon. Um, I just, I think that's cool. So we're going to go with a Argentinian manager, obviously. Um, because we're going to try to have to boost the... Uh, you want to boost the cam as much as we can. We have to search for an Argentina manager, and there we are. And then I think because of loyalty, our whole team should be on 10. No, we got to get a Prem, uh, prem consumable. So we're going to make him a Premier League manager. And uh, wow, we have a 1,000 a thousand leagues on this account. So in terms of the uh, the tactics and all that, I'll show you guys that in a minute. With the Hunter Kemp style, 82 acceleration, uh, 87 sprint speed, 91 attack position, 90, 90 finishing, uh, good shot power, good volleys, the rest... Obviously, uh, it's going to remain the same. So I think right away, uh, we'll start off with a 4-2-3-1. And then we'll test them there with Sané and um, Sané and Shakiri as our wide players. And then we'll eventually probably move on. And maybe try them out in a 4-1-2-2 uh, and two narrow. Or I guess something a little bit different. But I think for now, that's probably the best way to, to try them out and test them out. And then in terms of, uh, in terms of uh, work rates, I think I'm going to keep them on stay forward. And the reason for that is that I want this guy to be in the attack and also... He's a little bit slower, right? So I don't want, because of the pace, I don't want him tracking back a ton because it's going to be a lot to get him up the field, especially with medium low as well. We don't know what he's going to do work rate rise, work rate wise. So I think it's a good move to, it's a good look to keep that on. We're going to search for a game, guys. When we do get a game, you guys will be the first to know and we will get into the gameplay. All right, so our first opponent has a new SPC of Rooney and a fun looking team. 
Um, should be able to uh, should be able to perform well against this guy. What the heck? What a weird goal that was, man! Wow. Nice ball. Receives it back. Can't finish it, man. A little bit slow on that first touch there. Nice run. Oh, nice finish almost, but we miss it. Not an easy angle necessarily to hit. I was going for that cross goal, testing out the weak foot a little bit. Nice strength there. Good ball behind to Vardy. What a finish, man. First time shot. I feel like that's very effective at times. We got our first goal uh, with Mr. Juan Riquelme. We go 1-0. Nice finish there. Um, yeah, nice attack positioning. It took a little bit, obviously. You can see the pace, man. It did take a little bit for his run to continue and get there, but nonetheless. Nice ball. Come on, Shakiri. What a finish, man. This guy is a beast on the first time shots. That's for sure. The finishing is in full, full effect. And uh, two goals to go on his name. He's got a brace. What a weird goal. What a weird goal. But Shakiri puts it away. We go up 3 1. Very odd goal to score, but we'll take it. I feel like it's always taken a minute for me to kind of get him to trigger his run because of his pace. Like, he's not always... Ah, oh, he's so slow! This guy seems to be doing icon swaps. Um, so, again, if he's uh, if he's there at the end, we will give him the win. Obviously, you guys know we are testing out. Oh, what a ball. Oh, what a save from Subasic, man. What a finish, Shakiri. What a finish from our guy Shakiri. Teammates could potentially join in. Herrera. And will it be the level up? Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. And it's come off the keeper and a goal. Lovely. Lovely goal. Lovely. Nice. Good pass there. Finish that. Let's go. Nice finish. So his finishing seems very consistent at the top of the box. It's just about getting him to that point. Um, which seems to be the biggest problem with him right now is that his, his almost takeoff pace is too slow. Let's go! 3-2, baby! Riquelme puts us ahead. And I'm going to do my best now. Hopefully he doesn't leave. I'm going to give him um, the win, I hope. I actually think I know this guy. I'm not sure, though. But I'm going to try to give him the win right now. Um, just so he can get the swap win. But yeah, nice goal. So, boys, that is going to be the review today. Uh, we took him into two games, and I definitely have enough to know now about him. Um, in my opinion, he's a worse version of Kaká. That's really the best way to give you guys an understanding of what this guy is like. He's a worse version of Kaká. What I mean by that is that his positioning seems to be a bit worse, um, and he's just really slow. Even with the Hunter, man, he's really slow. I don't know what it is i think ea makes all these patches where defenders get faster so in this type of game and at this time in, in this time of the year 82 acceleration with the hunter is just not fast enough so i maybe even you try a shadow with this guy but i thought the hunter was good because i definitely noticed that his attack positioning his finishing was pretty good um his shooting was great so as like if you're not too worried about the pace i think overall this guy is really good um a little clunky but not really. I mean, I didn't really know his 84 agility. And, and I think the composure, the ball control, and the dribbling really showed through. His passing was sensational. Uh, and his strength was pretty good. 75 strength with 60, 6 foot, uh, 6 feet tall is, is pretty good. So I thought it was a, a, an okay card. I don't think it was anything special. I thought it was a little underwhelming. Um, obviously, he's going to drop a lot more. So he'll be a lot more affordable in the coming weeks because of the supply. He just came onto the game. 
Um, so yeah, I thought it was good to do a review on him today. I'm not wowed. It's not a guy that I would use. He's a little, he's not, he's usable. Uh, he's definitely usable. He's not amazing though. I think his pace really does hurt him in the long run. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys, uh, got something out of the video today and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Peace.